what is up awesome people so today i'm going to be showing you guys how to set up or and what i'm going to be doing for my rigs tomorrow at my uncle's with my cousins so as you guys know in my other video best one of the it was called one of the best baits for channel cats so what, that's what we'll be catching tomorrow is channel catfish it's so basically my uncle's house their, their backyard is basically a pond, and whenever we go over there for holidays and stuff like that, I always look forward to fishing and hanging out with family. And his cousins are just getting old enough to where my cousins, sorry, not his, my cousins, they're just getting old enough to where they can start fishing more, and they're getting into it more. So I'll be breaking down what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, and I also am going to be showing them how to fish tomorrow. So here's the rig right now. So I have a really sweet Sedona 2500 <clears throat> 2500 FD um sh sh Shimano Shimano that's how you say it Shimano reel um and this reel has all this reel has really just been an awesome reel it's been a great reel to me and it this rod has been awesome to me too I've had this rod for like literally basically my whole life it's a nice uh, two-piece ugly stick super sweet awesome little awesome little rod um oh shoot no no no, no. don't go through the last okay it didn't so i thought i almost went through the last hole so here's the rig so we got these really nice i love eagle claw by the way eagle claw snails they are as you can see size one over one over zero and they're quantity six. Hopefully we'll be catching some big ones with this tomorrow. Uh, here's the whole rig. It's like basically just a leader, honestly. Tied up. Here, let's see if you can. Yeah, there we go. There we go, let's focus on. Nice, awesome rig. And then we got these nice little bobbers. They're called glow bobbers, really nice. Uh, you can get them at Walmart for like two bucks. These are like 90 cents, I think I already said that, but 90 cents, super cheap, awesome. And then, so yeah, this thing glows up at night. So like there's little, these little sensors, th sensor things. And once it has water, these things glow up and they're super bright. It's insane. It's really cool, actually. So we are going to be rigging this up real quick. Oof, I'll put this over here. So here we go. My favorite knot, I mean, you can tell whatever. You can put that polymer knot. You can do whatever. But my favorite knot is just quick and easy. It's called the fisherman's knot. So you put it through, twist. So a whole bunch of people say twist a certain amount, but I don't really care that much. Just do as do as much as you please, just not too much to where it's like gonna fray your line. So you put that through the hole. Rod the tug end. Cinch it. Nice. Took off the tag end. Put it off just enough. And you got a really nice knot. Really nice, just like stacked knot. Really kind of makes you look like a pro too. Like, look at that. See, it's like stacked. It's really nice. I love this knot. It's, it's only came off a couple times because I didn't tie it right. It's really about how you tie it. If you tie it good, you're good. So, here we go. I usually have about a foot of line down. I normally do bottom rigs, but this is a smaller pond. So it's like super shallow. It's probably like five, deep, five feet deep. So I don't really need a bottom rig. I might though, because it's colder and I like to go down deep. And you just put that down. I don't know how to put up a bobber. Um, that is unfortunate. I'm not, um, I don't know about these basically just push down the sides, and it can be kind of hard, not going on. Like sometimes. Okay. But yeah, there you go. There's the rig, and I'll put some hot dog on the end. Hopefully, check out some biggins. But yeah, if you guys want to check out the hot dog video, go check it out. I just made it. It's called like best easy at home baits for catfish. And yeah, it's I, I honestly love it. It worked really well. So that's what I'll be using tomorrow. And yeah, that's that's about it, guys. I hope you guys have a fantastic day or night. No, actually, this is not about it. So I will be showing you guys tomorrow. I will be showing you guys 
the fish that I catch, um, if I do catch any, I probably, I probably will. I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm not too confident, but I'm confident enough that I'll catch a fish. So I will put some pictures in the end of the video and go check those out. All right, guys, see ya. What is up, guys? So we, I have been having an awesome Thanksgiving fishing day. We have caught around, I think, three, two really nice channel cats, probably above seven, ten pounds. Really nice, and the other one was pretty smaller that my cousin actually caught. Super awesome. Right now we have around four rods out. Just throwing them out with that rig that I showed you guys in the other little snippet. And at the end of this, we are still fishing right now, but at the end of this, I will uh, show you guys all the awesome fish that we caught. And this is, if you guys were wondering, this is what the lake, the pond kind of looks like. We have our lines out with bobbers and stuff. Uh, it's it's a blast. Um, I'm just having an awesome time with my cousins and family. And I hope you guys are all having an awesome Thanksgiving, and I hope you guys have a great one. But yeah, all right, guys. See you. What is up, guys? Um... I just got done reeling in probably a 20, 15 pound catfish, 20, maybe even 25. That thing was huge. And channel catfish, they don't get like humongous. That was a, that was definitely my personal best on those garlic dogs. Literally just the garlic dogs. The garlic dogs have been working today. Um, the jail dogs work on certain days. So... I will be. Sh I know I said that the next the next little snippet was gonna be pictures of the fish that I caught, but I just had I just had to stop and tell you guys that I just caught that. That was insane. I caught it on this little like Abby Garcia like setup. I think this thing stood it, fought it really well. Oh my gosh, that was that was a fun fight. That was a really fun fight. But yeah, um, that's about it. All you guys will see the pictures of all the fish that I caught, and yeah, hope you guys have. Have an awesome Thanksgiving. So, what is up, guys? So, this is a pretty small one. This one was pretty nice as well, this fish. This was a really nice one. That was a good one. But not as big as this guy. This guy was very big. This was the 20, 25, and I caught this on the garlic dog with that Albert Garcia that you guys saw. So, yeah, I hope you guys have an awesome one. And thank you for watching my video, and stay tuned. Bye.